Yeah, the great Ronald Wilson Reagan, the second best president of my life. The first being Bill Clinton. My buddy argues that Mr. Obama's the best president. I'm not ready for that yet. Anyway, Ronald Wilson Reagan quipped, he said, nobody ever died from hard work, but why take the chance? And he created a reputation for himself, much like Mr. Mr. Bush II, or as uh, Dave Chappelle called him, George Bush Jr., um, that they weren't very hard workers, and they also had reputations that they weren't very bright. Even though when they left office, their friends were worth billions. And they completely accomplished all their goals. They're idiots. That's the problem with the left. They don't understand what's really going on. And that's the thing to understand about work as it relates to your training. Work is very important. But the work has to create sufficient stress for your body to react by making growth hormone, testosterone. Or if you're interested in losing fat, then your body needs to get where in your recovery, your body is using oxygen at a higher level and you're burning fat in recovery. And those can only be created by stress of one kind or the other. Either the stress that comes from doing interval work or sprinting, or the stress, you know, that comes from uh, running fast. Because I assure you, sprinting is very difficult. And sprinting, I mean, that's why sprinters are the leanest, the most muscular athletes around. I mean, nobody thinks, why is a marathon runner relatively unmuscled and a sprinter is muscled? That must have something to do with the exercise. So anyway, today, I just did a couple of things. I did a squat. I worked up to 215 for sets of three, and I timed it. Took a minute and a half. I used a clock on my Android to keep track of the time. And I did some power cleans to start out, 165. I didn't catch the weight very well, so I think I'm even going to drop down weight next time because I'm not happy with my catches. I want to be comfortable with my catch because now I'm getting into a period when I'm going to be working more, walking more, so I don't want to stress myself out. But as I said, be very specific in your work in the gym. Be very goal-orientated. Be very uh, cognizant of what's going on in your body. Bye-bye.